of six decorators in the back. And we have one person, he does production, he's doing our showcase cakes. We have another young lady, she's doing a lot of the cupcakes, the pedophores, the dip decorated cookies, a lot of the smaller items that again, we sell for production. And then we have a team of four, they, they are focused on our custom decorated cakes. So the thing that's interesting is that they all have a strength. So Tina, as an example, she is known for her roses, which you see on that cake. Those, the roses on that cake are sugar paste roses, and I believe nobody can touch Tina when it comes to making a rose. So we call them Tina roses on our order. Uh, we tell people that there's a difference in roses, and these are very special. Uh, they're very delicate. They take a lot of time for her to make, but they make your cake gorgeous. And then you can actually save your topper. You can bring it back. We'll fix it up for you. So you can actually then put it in a display box and keep it. Uh, we have Jennifer, who's probably our, our one of our more senior decorators, I would say. She is an amazing artist. She expresses her emotion through her painting. Uh, we painted, uh, a woman came to us to paint her tattoos actually on a wedding cake. And so Jennifer and another decorator, Elizabeth, they did that and it was amazing. Heather, who, it was so funny, we tried to hire her away a couple of years ago. She was an icer somewhere, but we saw her potential. A couple of years later, she approached us and she is wonderful. And she loves to work in miniature. She loves gingerbread. She is an untapped talent and she is growing every single day and she will be amazing. She, she does do competitions. She wants to go to the National Gingerbread Competition and I think she's gonna play. She has placed in some gingerbread competitions already. And then we have Elizabeth who's probably, um, she's the last one to join our team. And she too, she's a painter. She likes to sculpt and do a lot of the dogs and trucks and, you know, those types of 3D cakes. They all do everything though. And they are a great team together because they complement one another. And then when you add in my husband, he is a master engineer and builder. Um, he actually designed an oil derrick that was eight and a half feet tall. It shot three and a half feet of fire on top of the eight and a half feet and chocolate oil. So that's probably also the most extreme cake we've ever done. And I'm proud of them. I think they do a great job.